Hello everybody, Tohami Pro here. Welcome to a brand new Hearts of Iron 4 tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to customize your division template. Now, if you want to know what a division template is, then let's look at this stack, okay? This is one division, or here this is six divisions, so we can see four infantry divisions, one garrison brigade, and one infantry type five. So those are all individual divisions. Now, if we want to go even more in depth, we can customize what is within those divisions. And to do that, we go on our recruit and deploy tab. And here we can see our division designer. And there's lots of things you can do, but I'm just going to be showing you how to change essentially the division itself, not really how to create new ones. Now, what we're going to do, let's say we're going to change our armor division. This, we're going to decide what we're going to do with it. So we click edit. Then here we can see what there already is. So I can add a support uh, battalion. So I could add rocket artillery or support artillery. So depending on what you're wanting to do with that army, then that'd be a decision you have to make. Now here we can see that even though it's an armored division, so that's what their focus is, I do have like quite a lot of infantry to support the the tanks just in case if that that um, division happens to be by itself away from any infantry I don't know main divisions right so I have a little bit of infantry to do that but let's say hey fuck that I want to have more armored I could I could do that now I'm not gonna actually make that decision because it costs me stuff I don't really I don't really want to do that now it does cost you uh, these uh, army experience points to change that. So I have 205 and if I wanted to add a heavy tank there or even a light tank it would cost 15. So just be careful and that also should show you one reason that you might want to invest in leaders in your government who would give you army experience because as we can see especially depending on the difficulty you're playing on what what you have within your division can really change a lot. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you have any questions at all, don't hesitate to comment because, you know, I like making these tutorials and uh, rate, comment, and subscribe. Peace.